Bitcoin against US dollar has found enough strength to push the price even more higher. What we can see, the price has tried to drop down, but unsuccessfully, where we can see the prices continue to move up on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday currently, where we can see on the Friday candle has made a bullish breakout, which is a very important signal for the price for the Bitcoin, because currently the price has made a breakout above very critical level and this needs to be confirmed in order to continue to move up. But everything looks bullish, so it's very good for the bulls. On the weekly time frame, we can see that the price has um, found enough strength and it's currently moving to the upside, where we can see it is a bullish candle forming here. We have two more days until, until this week ends, but what is very important is that the price is above this one, which is 38533 price level, which is a resistance level that is currently holding the price for, for, from moving up. If we go to the monthly time frame, we can see that this month has ended also as a bullish one. And it is at the very critical level, which is 38533, which is also a monthly resistance level. So it's very important for the price to make a breakout. So in order to continue and also to make the analysis on the monthly time frame, what I can see is this is a very important level for the price. We can expect and also I'm expecting that the price could make a bounce to here, which is 41,000 and then making retrace back down. So we will see much more clearly on the weekly and also daily time frames how these levels are behaving and also what are the targets. But currently what I can see on the monthly time frame, this is the target for the bulls. If the bulls could not manage to make a breakout around this price level, which is currently happening on the daily time frame, but needs to be also validated on the weekly time frame, we need to see the price going down and also there is a possibility that the price could go down. Not going as a bullish breakout, but reversing back down if there is a selling pressure holding the price and also pushing the price even more down. We'll see much more clearly what are very important levels for the sellers in order to push the price even more down. But for now, as it looks on the monthly time frame, uh, 36600 price level is very important level on the monthly time frame. Below that, the next one is 34600. So let's go to the weekly time frame and see how this looks. So the first one where the price needs to hold on the weekly time frame is this one, 37150, in order for the price to stay in the bullish mode. If the price goes down below 36370 price level, the first level where the price could stop is around this one, 36200, and below that is this one here, which is 35300. If the price goes down to this price level, this will be just um, some kind of a confirmation for the price uh, below before moving to the upside, but also it will be a test for the bulls. Are they enough strong to prevent the price from falling below 34500? On the weekly time frame, it is around 34600, but it's very close on the monthly, also on the weekly time frames. On the upside, if the price makes a breakout to the upside, 41,000 is on the monthly time frame as a target. You can see it here, it is visible around this one. But on the weekly time frame, where I'm expecting that the price could reach, and this one is 40,200. So this is the weekly target. So on the monthly, it is 41,000, on the weekly, it is 40,200. We'll see also what is the level on the daily. But if the price makes a breakout on the weekly time frame, this is the target I am expecting that the price will reach 40,200 and then making a reverse back down around 38533, confirming this bullish breakout as a valid one. So we will need to see what happens this week and also for the next week. This week is very important. We have two more days. Will the price manage to make a breakout to the upside? So it could happen that the price makes a breakout here right now in these two days and continues around this one and then retrace, retracing it back down. Let's see on the daily time frame well, how this looks. Well, let's check it here. Currently, what we can see here, the Friday candle has made a bullish breakout. So this is the first step for the price to reach 40,200, this which is visible here. You can see the next resistance level is 41,400, but below that is 40,800, which is very close to the monthly target, which is 41,000, I have mentioned. So, currently bullish bulls are making a breakout to the upside, so I'm expecting the price will make a 
today some kind of a bullish momentum to the upside and also a reversal back down around this one three eight zero 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 price level confirming this bullish breakout is a valid one but have in mind this is this this is the supply zone around this one the price needs to go above three zero 39000 in order to be a bullish breakout as a valid one so let's go in the past and see this price level here just a minute where it is 38 let's do it like this it will be much easier to find this area okay here it is price is currently here trying to make a breakout to the upside and we can see what is very important level it is 38823 very very important level for the price and you can see in the past when the price has tried to make a breakout to the upside you can see here when the price was heading up this price could needs to be broken in this case also we can see the price has tried to make a breakout to the upside after making a support here when the price has risen above 39,000 the price continued to move up and the price has reached 41,000 for sure we can see it here so this is the target what I'm expecting on the daily time frame but needs to be but we need to see how the price breaks above so before the price continues to move up and as it looks for me like right now the Friday bullish breakout it could be validated this day let's see how this day ends but have in mind if does if the price doesn't return back down it will be validated which means the price will continue to move up to the higher prior price levels if the price reverses back down back inside this one this will mean that this bullish breakout has not been validated and we need to see where the price will make a breakout from this indecision area where we can see the price was here for several weeks so this is the scenario for the sellers here pushing the price even more down around this indecision area and also this is the scenario for the bulls let's see what happens after this friday bullish breakout which has just happened before we end this analysis i would like to mention that below in the below the video inside the description you have a link where you can get a free pdf inside your email if you would like to get a tutorial with a step-by-step -step guide how to start trading and also how to use this supply demand strategies that i'm currently using so you can also use it on your own how to define also where the price could stop and also how to where the price could go in the future see you next time and happy trading that is all from today's analysis. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any question, feel free to leave a comment. If you like the analysis, click the like button and subscribe. See you next time and a happy trading.